This is the pre-build preparation for the real grade Zaku 2. When customizing your gun plot, you're going to be working with things like model glues, various types of paints, and also solvents like paint thinner or isopropyl alcohol are the two most common ones. You want to make sure that you're in a well-ventilated room because you don't want to be uh, inhaling the fumes because they could cause health issues or at the very least make you feel intoxicated. You're going to want to read any warning labels on any products that you use or do some research online to see if there's additional health uh, safety measures you need to take, such as respiratory gear or anything such like that. If you are working with isopropyl alcohol, do keep in mind that that is a wood alcohol which can cause serious health issues, including blindness if consumed. So you want to make sure that you definitely wash your hands after any exposure to it to make sure that you don't get it in your food later on. Now I'll be doing the panel lining and the only panel lining color I'll be using is the black and that is because all the pieces for this model are either a shade of green or a shade of gray so black's going to look the best for that. So let's just get right on into this.
Okay, now that the panel lines have dried, it's time to just clean up the excess and get them to be nice and neat inside the lines. So I've got my handy Despe enamel thinner. I've got my precision cotton swabs and any towels just in case anything spills. So let's just get right on into this.
and I'm done with the panel lining and cleaning them up. It's time to remove the pieces from the runners. So I've got my case here to hold the pieces in the various areas of the bot of the model that are going to be built. Got the manual here. I will be doing color correcting painting for these metallic colors, or at least the solid metallic colors. The copper here and the silver. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do yet with these other ones, which are uh, markings that have some metallic aspects to them. They're not all metallic. So I do have some third-party water slides that will replace all the ones over here, the normal stickers, but I still haven't figured out what I'm going to do with the, the ones that have like writing and other things plus the metallic. So I'll figure that out when I'm doing the build. So let's just get right on into this.
Thank you for watching this video right to the end. If you did enjoy it, please do give it a thumbs up. That does help out the channel. If you would like notifications as to when new videos are posted to this channel, please do subscribe and hit that notification bell. Also, what I have done is I have set up a Google Calendar to show my build schedule. So if you're interested in finding out what I'm building and when, please do subscribe to that. The link is up here. If you do have time, please do enjoy one of the videos that are popping up around my head.